is similar with Dart because in Dart, they have this ternary operator. In PHP 7.4 or above, they have this ternary operator as well, which we can use. And with this, you see the similarities between PHP and Dart. So over here, we'll use a ternary operator. First, we'll take status, and we'll see if status equal one, we'll see if this matches, then we'll say it's paid. Otherwise, over here, we'll say pending, that's it. So this simple line over here, this simple syntax is the similarities between Dart and PHP in terms of ternary operator. Of course, PHP also supports double question mark operator, which Dart has. We'll see them in future in our course. Anyway, so now let's go ahead and save it. Now, if you come to our backend over here and uh, over here, you see that status pending and paid because earlier we have seen here one and here's zero. So zero means pending, one means paid. And this is exactly we have set over here. One means paid and zero means pending. In this case, which in our case, if the condition doesn't match, we return pending. And with this, we also learn the similarities between Dart and PHP in terms of ternary operator.